So now we have seen using pointers with arrays. Now let's try to get a string from the user and try to display the reverse of it using pointers. So first of all, let me declare a character array. I will say char str of 15. And now let me display a message saying enter a string. And also let me write the C in statement. Now we know that a string is an array of characters. To display a string in reverse, we need to show each and every element of the character array in descending order. And for that, first of all, we need to know the length of the character array, that is the length of the string. So for that, I will use a for loop, which will go till the null point of an array, that is the end point. And also with that, to store the end point's address value, I will use a character pointer, which will also act as an counter variable for the loop itself. So let me declare the character pointer. So I'll say care star ptr is equal to str, that is the base address of the array str. Now let me write the loop that will go till the null point or the end point of the array. So I will say for and I want that this loop should go on till the value stored at the pointer ptr is not equal to, I will simply say void. Let me write the increment statement ptr plus plus. Now since we don't have anything to write in the code block, I can simply give a semicolon here and end this for loop here itself. Now we have the address of the last element of the array. Now we can display the elements in descending order. So let me write a for loop for this as well. So the condition will be till ptr is greater than equal to the base address, that is the address of the zeroth element, that is str. And here I will say ptr minus minus. And every time I will display the value stored at ptr. So I will write C out star ptr. So now let's run this. Let me enter string. And you see it displays the reverse. Let me add an ENDL statement here. Now let's try it again. Let me write name and it has printed the reverse. 